Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's been a few weeks, maybe about a month or so since I last posted and I'm sorry about that. Next week I'm going to VidCon. Actually, probably this week. By the time this video is up, it's probably going to be this week. And then I'll have a video hopefully by the next week. So basically today I just wanted to show you guys, for those of you who are interested in starting a YouTube channel and editing, if you have a MacBook, Final Cut Pro, as you guys know, costs money. So I have a quick little tutorial for you guys on how to get it for free. So what you're gonna have to do is go download the free trial first. Apple is probably going to give you like 90 days for you guys to use and once those 90 days are up i have a solution for you guys to reinstate the trial it's all completely free you don't have to pay out of pocket it doesn't require any credit card information nothing. before we get started on this tutorial i do want to say a quick disclaimer just mentioning that this is simply all for educational purposes i don't intend to show you guys this for any other reasons except for educational purposes so i'm going to show you guys a quick little screen recording on how you're supposed to do it so first as i'm opening final cut pro you guys can see that my trial has expired i'm going to go ahead and show you guys how to reinstate it so you guys can be able to reopen and start Final Cut Pro like when you first had the trial. So what you're gonna do is press these commands. You're gonna type in terminal and then you're gonna open that. And once terminal is open, you're going to copy this exact code that I'm going to have in the description down below as well as in the comments just in case. Once you have pasted, click enter and it should automatically submit and your trial should reinstate. Now let me show you guys that it works. I'm opening Final Cut Pro right now. And as you guys can see, I have my 90 days back again. And when I press OK, Final Cut Pro opens once again and I'm able to start editing and get back to working. So I hope this video helps you guys out for those of you guys who are wanting to start editing and upgrade from iMovie. I hope it helped. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, make sure to leave a thumbs up and make sure to support by subscribing to my channel. I have good content coming out in the next couple of weeks. I hope you guys enjoy that. But yeah, with that being said, I hope you guys have a good rest of your day and I'll see you guys hopefully next week. Peace.